okay this is gold and at the daily chart now you can see gold is running in uptrend in a large time frame so if you now see in this area uh, price are creating new higher high and higher low but according to the stochastic uh, they are not able to create new higher high so means here that uh, they are losing their momentum all right so in that area we have seen this is uh, bearish engulfing pattern so we are expecting it will uh, give a correction from this level and at that time let me show you the next uh, support so and a connect most recent swing point so here because uh, this line are respecting both sides as a resistance and as a support so uh, they are respecting both sides so if price break this lower point so let me show you exactly uh, this lower point so I'm looking for short to this level. So let me draw a horizontal line by connecting this point. So I can see this is the lower point and I'm, I'm looking for a breakout. Once they break this level, so I'm looking for short, but otherwise I'm not looking for short. So in that case, I need a breakout around 4630. Uh, all right, uh, if price break this level, uh, 46,300. So I'm looking for short and the next target will be 4480 or 4490 we can say that will be my next target. So let's see in a small time frame uh, like 15 minutes and so here you can see they are running in a sideways market and this is right now sideways zone somewhere here. Price are running like that sideways but I need a breakout. So once they break so definitely I will go for short. So next, uh, most of the people are thinking for the buy. So I'm not interested to take buy right now, but uh, if price break this level, here, let me connect this swing point. If price break the level around 47150, so I'm looking for buy. Or you can say 200, let's say. All right. 47,200 price break this level so definitely i'll go for buy so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching